I'll be showing you a Shopify inbox tutorial. I'll be taking you through how to set up the app step by step. So let's start from the very beginning here and head to the Shopify inbox app store page. And let's go and install the app. And this app is built completely by Shopify and it is completely free. And it's a super easy way to communicate with customers. So once you're on the app listing page, if you don't have it installed, click install. This is going to bring us to the installation sequence, which is first the app permission page. If you're comfortable with this, you can hit install here. So this brings us to the apps overview page. First, what we want to do is head to the online store chat is off. So we want to click set up chat as we want to enable this for our store. So this brings us to the app embed section of our Shopify theme, and it's going to toggle it off by default. Now to note in here as well, there are a few customization settings. So we can set the brand customization. So the background to our chat icon, let's say we want to make this a bright red. We can see the preview in the bottom right here. We could also set the text color as well as the button color. We can set the icon to either a chat bubble. It could be an email icon, a question mark. It really depends what you're looking for. We can label it to either be chat, assistant, or something else. We can set the horizontal position. Maybe you want it to be on the left-hand side instead. Let's say I want it to be not at the bottom right completely, but a little higher up. I can also set the welcome message here. And the default is hi, message us with any questions. We're happy to help. So I'll leave this as a default. I'll hit save in the top right here to finalize those changes. And if I head back to the inbox page here, I can see it's now on. So the next thing we'll do is we'll set up our chat settings. So on the left hand side under inbox, I'll click chat settings. And there are a few things we can go and customize. So first is our instant answer section. This is going to be at the bottom of our chat widget, and it's going to let us support customers proactively by providing automated answers to common questions, letting them get answers immediately without needing to write a message. So by default, we have track my order. It's going to give us automated suggestions using AI, but we can go and create different instant answers such as do you offer promotions? I could say, yes, we have sales on a monthly basis. So if I hit save here, I've just created that instant answer. If I go back to the previous tab, I can then reorder this. So if a customer wants to get an instant answer, they could click on one of these buttons here and it's gonna give them that answer I just wrote out. For the next section, we have the pre-chat form. So if customers leave the online store during a conversation, your response will be sent to the email provided. We can also show marketing opt-in for customers. So as they're entering the chat here, before they get started, they have to enter in information and we can add this toggle here and if they do toggle it, we can then send them marketing emails. So I'll just leave that on there. The message is just going to be opt-in to get special promotions and updates. You can opt out anytime and you're free to change this message as well. To finalize these changes, we can hit save in the top right and let's move to availability. And so the availability setting is just going to dictate when this automated first reply is sent. So you can set the hours for your store. Currently, they're set to go all day. But we can turn on an automated message. So let's say you're online from nine to three. Otherwise you want to send them an automated message saying we only do support from nine to three, but we'll be in contact as soon as possible. We could either set this automated first reply to run during available hours or outside. I'll just say during available hours. We can go and add that text in there. We respond in 12, let's just say six to 24 hours. I think it's important here just to give context on how long the time window is you're going to respond. And especially if you're a solo founder or something like that, and it's just you, you can't be online all day. You have to sleep, you have to go eat. I think it's important to set those expectations for a customer or anyone who's sending you a message. So next, let's head to quick replies here. So this allows you to create pre-written messages to make replying to a customer fast and efficient. So these are essentially shortcuts here, such as thanks, and it's going to turn into thanks. Please let us know if we can help with anything else. If you just type order, it's going to say, we're happy to check your order status. What is your order number? And so on. And so you can create these quick replies to help save you time. So let's go check out the actual inbox. So I'll click inbox again. Then I can see my view messages tab at the top here. So clicking this is going to open up my Shopify inbox. Here I can see open messages, closed messages, which ones are assigned to me, which ones are unassigned, and which ones are unread. In the bottom left hand side, we have more settings where we can set our quick replies, our message preferences. Our notifications as well. You can turn off or turn on desktop notifications to make it easy to know when you actually have a message, such as email, push, 
and so on. So let's go and preview how this looks on our store. So I'll click view your online store. This can open up a new tab. I can see the chat widget in the bottom left. So I'll click on this. You can see I've tried to have a test conversation here. So if I open up in an incognito browser, let's try that again. I'll click test. I can see my instant answers such as do you offer promotions? It's gonna look like it's typing. Give me a response, the one that I pre wrote out. Let's exit out of this. And I can write a message here saying, hi, how are you? It's going to prompt me to enter in the details. So if I just go and enter in some test information here, let's hit start chat. I'll say hi, or just okay, thank you, as I already did say hi, how are you? If I head back to my Shopify inbox, I can see the message I just got from this person saying conversation started from online store and I can go and respond to this chat as the merchant. I'll just say, awesome, let me know if you have any questions, not worrying about spelling there. Let's hit send. And overall it makes it super easy to have a conversation with a customer. If you've made any sales on Shopify, you know how hard it is to keep track of how much money your store has actually made. That's where our sponsor ProfitCalc comes in, the one-click profit calculator available for your Shopify store. All you have to do is select the date range you're looking for to get real-time calculations so you can see how profitable you are in just one click. It's gonna give you your revenue, cost of goods sold, transaction fees, all your ad spend from all your different accounts from Facebook, Google, Snapchat, Bing, Pinterest, and TikTok, as well as your transaction fees and any other monthly expenses. It's gonna break everything down into an easy to understand dashboard with tons of analytics and metrics so you can start making smarter business decisions. There's a 15 day free trial so you can test drive everything for yourself and you can find it in the Shopify app store by searching profit calc and then looking for this logo in the top left here there's also a link in the description below that will bring you to the Shopify app listing. So make sure you check that out and start your 15 day free trial. So in conclusion, Shopify inbox is super easy to set up. It makes it super easy to customize your brand settings to match your store theme, to enter in your notification and response information to create instant answers, as well as shortcuts and quick replies. And the best part is, is that it's completely free and it makes it super easy to get started no matter where you are in your Shopify store journey. If this video helped at all in you getting Shopify inbox set up, I would love it so much if you smash that like and subscribe button below. If you have any questions, leave a comment, but thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.